N7 fuel reactors this is another multiplayer N7 mission. So you're gonna breeze through it because you know it like the back of your hand. Uh, this one was not in the beta, so I don't know this one. Oh no, was this one in the beta? This one was in the beta. Was this in the beta? <laughs> Shit, I can't remember. I remember the outside one. No, this one was not in the beta. I don't think. How many were in the beta? Just two. Then this was not. Because I remember the two from the beta, even though I didn't play it. But I'm very familiar with this one for some reason. <laughs> Probably because I played the hell out of multiplayer for yeah. a while there. Hmm. Oh well. So we got a puzzle! Even though it's like one of the dumbest fucking puzzles in the game. So you have three buttons. Uh, middle one is activate, which basically like lifts up or puts down wherever the crane is. And then the button on the right moves it to the right. No. And then you drop the block, and then you move the crane back left, and then you activate again, and then you move it right. And oh boy, he solved the puzzle. Complicated stuff. I don't know why this is in here. It's really yeah. fucking stupid. Really stupid. They don't even give you access to the crane game. That's like a dumbed down version of the crane game. Dude, how awesome would that be if you like if you had access to a crane and you had to grab a brute as it was running by? Yeah, Actually, those good. things are kind of slow, so it'd be an interesting challenge. And then for bonus points, you could grab a, a banshee, but those things teleport, so they're super hard to grab. But that's like uh, <laughs> getting the diploma, the Harvard diploma from the crane game. Ah, uh, yeah. So. If, it, if you Keeps get it, slipping through your fingers. Yes, you really earn that Harvard diploma if you get it out of there. So you do all that. How hard and is then this I compared to forgot what I'm supposed to do? A multiplayer mission. Uh, it depends on the difficulty of the multiplayer mission. So you're playing this single player, the hardest possible difficulty. Yep. What's easier, this or gold? Uh, this much, 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 this much, much, silver. much, much, much easier. Um, that's when it gets into your teammates. Okay, so this is like silver level. Thing. Yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. There's a little switch. Bronze um, level. It's difficulty. Uh, yeah. So uh, the the Reapers, which is who you're. Oh no, no, no! You're playing N7 on this. I think. Yeah, it's an N7 mission. So you're fighting Cerberus on this. Durr. Durr, Dan. Yeah, I'm Durr. Just, I'm just letting you work that out in your mind <sighs> aloud. Um, oh, no, you are fighting the Reapers. I was right. Huh. Anyway, so the Reapers are really hard. They're, I, I like to play as the Adept in multiplayer, which... Uh, uh, I, Cerberus is the... Aren't you playing the Easiest. Adept here? Yes. Okay. You play the same class in multiplayer. Yes. I. It's the most fun for me, because it does. it's not like every other motherfucking shooter out there, you know? Which is why I'm doing this in the first place. Doing it, doing the guide this way. Because how many games do, you, you do I make a guide for a year where I just run around and shoot everything in the all, head? All of them. Every game, ever. But it seemed like in the beta of this, you were playing mm -hmm. Vanguard exclusively. Well... And then I played through the first bit of this game as a Vanguard on Insanity, and it wasn't fun. Like, it was so crazy hard because, you know, the very unique power to the Vanguard is flying, jump. Flying across yeah. the screen. Yeah, and it was either, like, but apparently... Do you still like you, it you in can multiplayer? Get the, <clears throat> the Vanguard? Yeah. Yeah, but it's not really feasible to use on super hard difficulties because you end up, like, point blank next to super strong enemies. Yeah. So you... You're either the vanguard, and you're only using like the lightest weapon possible, so that uh, the recharge time for your jump mm -hmm. is two hundred percent, or you're not using that a lot. So it ends up being the same kind of thing. Like you, you're Might as well not using powers constantly anyway. So I don't know. I've I saw something online like someone made a strategy video of um, the fastest way to get through uh, any gold mission, basically the fastest way to earn money for multiplayer. Uh -huh. And apparently, like in it was a very specific team build. I think it was like two adepts and a vanguard and an infiltrator or something like that. And apparently, the easiest team to kill is the reapers. Um, but I don't know. When, when you get to that point in the game, like, what's the point? 
like why you, you can run through an entire gold mission in like 10 minutes so you're getting all this money so you can go through gold faster like yeah. I, I, the loot's not that great in this game I don't know and I say that with confidence because I just started playing Diablo 3 uh -huh. which is the biggest loot horror game in the world <laughs> and uh yeah, like, I, I don't know. The, the multiplayer was fun for me for a while, but it's I haven't touched it in, like, two or three weeks now. Yeah. Like, a, after that first kind of Are initial... Done? Yeah, I'm completely done with it. Like, they've... I They added a new update with some new characters and stuff and some new maps, but the new characters, even, you have to unlock them. So it could take a while to get them. So it's not particularly that fun. Or, like, it's... Not that it's not fun, it's that... It, you could play for days and not get the new character. Yeah. So it's like, eh, whatever. Not my cup of tea. So, now I got uh, one final brute. And they got those little shield generators, so be sure to shoot those when you can. Because um, they make them very hard to kill if you don't. Did you play multiplayer when you tried the beta at all? Or the demo? Whatever it was called? No, I did not. Nope. Why not? I didn't get to it. <laughs> so you just had no interest in it? I don't know. Like, So, like, it came out, mm -hmm. and I made the videos for single player, like, as fast as I could. Mm -hmm. And then you started playing the beta, and we did a live stream of it, and I watched you play a lot of it. So, And by that time, I'm like, eh, whatever. <laughs> I it, it watched two hours of it. It doesn't look that good. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. Eh. Yeah, it was fun for a while, but it doesn't have any staying power for personally. Like it's not. I don't know. I enjoyed it, but not. I mean, if I was playing like, it with friends, I, I'd what probably could they, like it. I'm but. trying to think of what they could have changed, like what they would need to add one small feature to make it make me go back to it, and I can't think of one. Yeah, I'm I'm moving on.